Big yikes. Kimberly Guilfoyle went on her podcast to slam President Joe Biden for taking a walk with his wife, Jill Biden, while the Israel-Hamas war has yet to be resolved. As the risk of war escalates in the Middle East, Biden takes this week once again, taking a breather with a walk along a Delaware beach even as Israel warns of Hamas efforts to make chemical weapons and the continued outcry over hostages being held captain by these terrorists, the TV star, 54, said in a video clip, posted to X, formerly known as Twitter. Under the video, the caption reads, Kim is outraged that Joe and Jill Biden took a walk on the beach on Sunday while hostages were being held captain. Of course, people couldn't believe her big slip-up, as she meant to say, held captive, instead of, held captain. One person wrote, Kim please not today, while another said, what a clueless loser Kim is. A third person added, it's a terrible thing to be held captain. Majorly. Others pointed out how the president, 80, just got back from Israel, while in times of crisis, Donald Trump would frequently be seen on the golf course. They do not get to complain when Trump spent half his time in office on one of his golf courses, while charging the American taxpayer exorbitant fees, one person said, while another added, I guess it would have been okay if he had been playing golf. As OK previously reported, Guilfoyle, who is engaged to Donald Trump Jr., has gotten people riled up after her remarks on her podcast. Recently, she claimed Democrats want to lock up Trump supporters. They want to silence and censor political opposition and throw us all in jail. It is why the stakes have never been higher and why Donald Trump's 2024 campaign is only gaining more momentum because he's ready to stop it once and for all, she said in the clip, which was captioned, Kim says Democrats want to put all Trump supporters in jail, and he is the only one who can stop it from happening. People then commented on her baffling remarks. One person wrote, she sounds like that preacher woman now, the one that talks to God all the time on a daily basis, while another said, anyone that commits crimes go to jail. No matter who they are. A third person fumed, they just can't stop lying. While a fourth said, what is with that family? All they do is lie. A fifth user simply said, if they're criming, then yes.